I'm Bentley Calverly. I've been in the art business for more than 45 years, and the one question that I'm constantly asked is, how are prices established? And it's really very simple, and there is a method to it. Um, when an artist first starts, hopefully with a little guidance from professionals, they establish a base price. And then, as their career uh, progresses, uh, they find a gallery, they're included in some solo shows, uh, group shows, solo shows, and then hopefully they get collected by um, different corporations, different major collectors. The museums start to acquire them and show them. And all the while, their prices rise because their resume is increasing. It's very similar to how the rest of us work in the world. You know, when you start out, you're hopefully um, at a, a kind of a base salary, and as your skill improves, your salary improves because your resume got longer. And that's what art galleries and museums lend to the artist. Uh, the other thing that's interesting is that the artwork for the same size canvas whether you're looking at it in New York or Los Angeles, Chicago or Phoenix, is the same price. There's very, very little fluctuation in the prices um, unless you're crossing international borders, in which case, you know, with the currency, there can be a little bit of a, of a, of a switch. But it's really very methodical and very transparent. I hope this helps.